Hello, we found a compatible uh, solar inverter for our high voltage uh, uh, pilotic batteries. This battery bank works up to 360 volts. It comes in modules, battery modules of 96 volts. So if you have four of these batteries together, you can reach the 384 volts actually. A compatible inverter that can handle the Pilotec Force H2 batteries is the Solis 3-phase 10 kilowatt. It's quite a small inverter because it's high voltage. It's not 48 volt based. Bear in mind that works only with high voltage batteries. That's the mounting plate of the inverter. Three current clamps in the box from Istron. Or CTs, current clamps, current transformers. Uh, I think there is also the instrument meter with Modbus signal SDM 630, a well known meter. It is used by our inverters in Voltacon. Istron is a, is a very, very reliable brand. On this side, we have more accessories three phase plug for the input and the output with the Allen kit, and plenty of MC4 connectors. Because this inverter has how many? One, two, three, four MPPT controllers. So we have plenty of MC4 connectors for our solar panels. Go inside the box. That's the screen, quite basic screen, but using the Wi Fi you can read more data online. A massive heatsink, aluminium heatsink, no fans, it's a fanless design. The MPPT ports on off for the DC side, battery terminals, the CAN bus, this is used for uh, communicating with the BMS, the Wi-Fi, the RS485, mainly for the energy meter, here you can download data from the COM port and the input and output uh, uh, three-phase plugs. Bear in mind, moving from uh, the 48 volts to high voltage batteries, the standard 48 volt battery used to be like this the cables of the batteries. If I had the 48 volt 10 kilowatt inverter, this is the type of cable that we need. Between 75 and 95 square mil. Because we have a really high voltage inverter that goes up to 600 volts, this is the cable we need. This is not for the solar panels, it is actually for the battery. If you look at the battery terminals, this, side, this is where you plug your positive and your negative uh, power cable and this is going to go back to the solis inverter with the right uh, uh, crimp you can see it's using mc4 connectors here and there so that's a, an important advantage when we move uh, to uh, high voltage batteries with high voltage inverters so that's our new product that's a nice setup uh, we will upload more videos to show you how to connect the cables and how to program the inverter. Thank you for watching.